Hello everyone. In this video, we will see how to recharge your Tata Sky DTH connection using your credit card. If you have not already subscribed to my channel, please subscribe now by clicking on the subscribe button. So let's start. As usual, open up the web browser and enter https www.mytatasky.com and then hit enter. Once the page loads up, you can see login to manage your My Tata Sky account. By default, the registered mobile number is selected and you will have to enter the registered mobile number. Otherwise, you can enter the subscriber ID and then continue to recharge. I will leave it unchanged and continue with registered mobile number since that is easy to remember instead of remembering the random digits. So I enter the registered mobile number. and then click submit. In the next page, you will be able to see your account name, your subscription ID, my account logout. You don't have to enter your password as such in order to do a recharge. And on the left hand side, you can see your balance, your due date. If you have crossed the due date and you have not recharged before that, you will find this in a displayed under the due date section. If you want to continue the subscription of your current package, you can see what is the current package cost. It says rupees 280 for 30 days. If you wish to change the subscription or if you wish to add new channels or change your subscription pack, you can click here and change the pack. Changing the subscription packs, adding new packs, all those things will cover in another video. So in this, we'll proceed with the recharge. So the total amount due now was 280. I just enter the total amount here and then click go. So here you are given different coupons. You can just select any of the coupons here for up to 280 rupees. So I click on this eBay coupon and i have remaining 80 rupees for which i can select any other coupon okay i have this print land order okay i click add so i've got uh, this coupon now i've selected both the coupons for uh, amounting up to 280 rupees so whatever is your recharge amount up to that amount you'll be able to select some coupons once you have chosen your coupons on the right hand side you can see this proceed to recharge Click on proceed to recharge. On the left hand side, you can find different options that is UPI, debit card, credit card, net banking, Paytm and MVisa. In this, we will be seeing how to pay through the credit card. So I'll select credit card. I select uh, what, what kind of credit card is it? Mine is a Visa credit card. So I select Visa and click pay now. Just taking some time. Uh, now we are redirected to the payment gateway page and you can see this merchant name Tata Sky and the payment amount 280 rupees. So I enter the credit card number. I enter the expiry date. I enter the CVV code which is present at the back side of your credit card. Enter that, the three digit CVV code. Enter the name as mentioned on the credit card. Once you have entered all the details, click on make payment. Now you are redirected to the Citibank two factor authentication where you will have to enter the IPIN or the internet PIN. So I enter the internet PIN, which is same as the uh, net banking password for Citibank. Once you have entered the IPIN, click next to continue. If the details are correct, the authentication will be successful and you will be redirected to the Tata Sky page where you will be given the where you can see the confirmation message. Thank you. Your account has been successfully recharged with rupees 280. Click here to do another payment. Please proceed to channel packages. So you can select here to add or upgrade your channel packages. Coupons are mentioned over here. And when you scroll down, you'll get the transaction details, the Tata Sky subscriber ID, 
transaction id date and time bank transaction service tax number service category that's all guys thank you for watching please like and share this video and do subscribe to my youtube channel thank you